Hello, hello, our esteemed viewers. Thank you for joining us today. Welcome to another captivating episode of DSA Superstar Show. I'm your host, Bermnet Zeneva. Today, we have the pleasure of interviewing the remarkable 2023-24 grade 12 students of DSA for the first time this academic year. Without further ado, let's dive into the program. Stay with us until the end of the show. This is DSA Superstar Show. <music> Okay, welcome to the program. Thank you for having me. It's really a pleasure to have you for the interview. I hope you'll have a delightful time. Please introduce yourself to your audience. Uh, hi, my name is Heyman Giesenetz. I'm a CMC 12th grade student. Okay, Heyman, reflecting your time at GSS from the first day up to now, what do you want to achieve? Um, I've been here in Gibson for, uh, starting from second grade. So I've, I've been here about a lot of my life. So um, I would like to achieve a good matric score since I'm a 12th grade student right now. Yeah, that's so, the main goal. Good. As a grade 12 student, what are your aspirations for this year and what do you hope to achieve? Well, GPA is a big deal right now. So uh, to improve my GPA as much as I can and have a good matric score, like a perfect matric score if I can. No, excellent. So let's dive into your exceptional qualities uh, beyond academics. You have dedicated yourself to promoting young girls through volunteering and charity work, right? What motivates you to pursue these noble causes? Well, I've been, my parents used to do that all the time when I was a child. So mm -hmm. I always wanted, I always wanted to be like them. So I always wanted to help kids that are, that needed help. And we always used to help the school that I help right now with my parents. So um, I, we used to do a lot of things for them, but then at some point the government told us, it's okay, we can handle it. And we're like, okay. So the school called us like this year and they're like, we need help. So we had to help them as much as I can. Um, I collected some money and brought them some books, um, some sanitary pads for the girls. Cause most of the kids don't, most of the kids like miss school because of these reasons. Mm -hmm. So I, I wanted to help that. Oh, that's really great. Even recently, you generously donated some school supplies and sanitary materials uh, for one of the school found in Addis. Uh, so could you please share the details of uh, this initiative with us? Yeah, well, as I said, we used to help them. And right now they called us because they, they needed help. So I collected some money from some families, some friends. Some of my friends helped me out too. So um, we gave them what, what we can. I mean, it's it's not enough, but we gave them what we can. So I'll try to I'll try to like give them more if I can. And it's not just me with my friends too. We're we're thinking about doing more for for the for those kids. No, well, that's really uh, great. Looking ahead, what are your future plans? What do you envision yourself in the coming 10 years well help more kids as i saw right now i mm -hmm. really want to help them so help more kids um be successful make my parents proud yeah nice nice amen before you conclude i would like to give you the opportunity to express your gratitude to those who have supported you along this journey well my friends and family and well, God to help me. So I would like to thank them all. So thank you. Okay, Heman, I'm truly really delighted to have had the privilege to host you in my today's show. I wish you all the best in your future endeavors. Thank you for gracing us with your presence. 
Yeah, thank you for having me. Thank you. Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, I trust that you have thoroughly enjoyed today's show. We kindly urge you to continue indulging in our captivating reporter of previous interviews, conveniently accessible on JC's YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Mm -hmm.